Yeah, let's start here. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Multiple Dimensions, Part 46, New Direction, Part 2. In today's episode, we re-entered, we reflected on some feedback we've been getting. The motto is absorb it and keep moving forward. We are evolving our ability to work with slow tempo expression and phrasing, although fast stuff like you just heard is totally awesome. Sometimes we can't and sometimes we can rush through working on our music when we're trying to feel our way through an expression. Hearing with fresh ears counts for a lot. We continued our work with poise and basically made the overall poise arcs more cohesive. We tightened the bass part and we made it bouncier and lighter in certain areas and got more contrast between the arcs and you'll hear that in a bit. We continued our work with spatial oral recordings using our digital audio workstation. For example, if we play the unspatialized version, and the spatialized. So, we recorded the spatial version. We also experimented with using WAV files as well as MP3. We continued our work with the animation. Um, we updated what we call the pastel shapes scene. And we have a made a recording of that. So that looks like this. And as you move along, the four shapes play the four parts of the instruments. You can hear that bouncy bass. Instead of the bass just constantly being low and slow, now it's up an octave and, and faster, shorter eight, eighth notes. So it really makes a light part when we need light, light. We also made a bunch of new shapes. We made what we're calling hollow cloud and hollow plaque shapes, and we were rotating them to get those different shapes that you saw a minute ago when we came in on the introduction. And then we made a new recording, another recording of the animation using the composite hollow shape scene and the Reaper spatial recording. So what we're going to do for you is play the um, the new newest animation hot off all off the press here this one let's stretch it so you can see it a little bit and uh, that should bring us home and uh, basically there are four instruments and they are represented by four four shapes on here, see if you can figure out what they are. So here we go.
So that concludes today's episode. <clears throat> what we're noticing, this is the first time we've, along with you, watched this scene, animation, all the way through. And it really strikes us how visually you can see the aural volumes coming at you. And then the playful side of like that last arc uh, is kind of emphasized with boom, boom, boom. And then, uh, and then the dramatic, long, slow parts are also emphasized kind of at the top. So anyway, we like it. Um, our ideas for next time are to uh, update the, anno the uh, score annotation because we added a little bit of polyphon to ARC-5, um, which may or may not have adjusted the harmony. Uh, make some more recordings. Uh, maybe some more ideas for the animation and our good old friend uh, to be determined a shout out to Legzy Kirby for stopping by and Miss Cleo um, thank you as always and thank you for your time attention curiosity and interest do come back do take care and do keep on streaming